Welcome, this is the Energy Vibration Reading for the month of April for the Gemini Sun, Moon, and Rising Sign. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. Thank you for the wonderful positive energy vibration. Please like and share these videos. And um, I want to say to each and every person, thank you for the um, wonderful positive energy vibration that you guys send. This month is just going to be a fabulous month for you guys. So um, let's check out what is coming up for the Gemini. So we are calling in the spirit guides and the light beams for the Gemini Sun on the rising sign to show us what's coming up in the first week. We have four weeks in this month, and in the first week, we have victory and success. We see you coming in first week, whatever you decide to do, it's a yes, go ahead, it's going to be positive, okay. And you are moving forward. And so, uh, um, we have some judgment call that is going to be coming in the energy of water in the second week. There's definitely some judgment call that we have um, the energy of the world. Um, but it, the judgment call is going to be we're going to be seen, and it has to do um, in the last week of water energy. So, you guys have two water energies. So, there is no supporting energy except in the third week. So the first week and the third week is going to be good. Um, the second week there is going to be information that is coming out, so be aware of this. And um, the third week, the energy of the hurt. This is good because it's all about your materialistic world, which is really wonderful. It's about uh, your possession, your assets, and that sort of a thing. We have the energy of the moon, and I'm seeing that some of you are really tearing your enemies apart. You're pulling them down, you're taking them down, and this is really, really good. Now, the energy of the chariot is coming up in the first week, and the energy of judgment in the second week have to do with some success is going to be coming to you guys. So whatever the energy um, that there was, success is going to be coming. So the first week and the second week, First week, you can um, whatever you decide to do is going to be good. There's going to be um, some success with uh, um, if you are having um, um, you know situations with your car or your vehicle. There is definitely going to be some good news and some success that is coming in. Judgment is here, and the energy of judgment have you have to do with the Queen of Cups. Okay, so whoever, um, if this is uh, your mother or father whoever this person is some judgment call is going to be coming in but it's going to be positive because whoever this person is a pisces cancer or a scorpion this lady is 45 years and older okay she could be collaborating um or with a capricorn or they're going to be helping you okay whatever that is happening they are definitely going to be helping you now we have the energy of the world and we have the energy of the moon and the lovers comes up so Definitely, you Gemini's. It's going to be um, some of you Gemini's are going to be finding out something about your partner. Okay, so um, this whatever you're about to find out about your partner. If your partner is a Pisces, Cancer, or Scorpion, you're definitely going to be finding out something about your partner. Some of you could be connecting with a Pisces, Cancer, or a Scorpion person and uh, in a relationship, and um, this is going to be a very positive relationship. Now. The other energy that we have is that news is going to be coming in, and whatever news is coming in is really some positive news that is going to be coming in. So that is a good. Then we see the Eight of Swords, but you are um, trying to figure out something about your financial, about your materialistic world in the third week. So this energy is definitely coming up in the third week where the energy of the world is. So something is ending, but something new is going to be coming out for you and it's going to be in a very very positive outcomes as a king of swords so you men um 45 years and older um it's going to be um very good so whoever um you men 45 years and older and um, you're going to be receiving some news um and uh, um a lot of news could be coming, but the news is that someone is victorious over you. So you men 45 years and older, a lot of news could be coming, but someone else is victorious over you guys because you're going to receive the news that someone else is victorious over you guys. Then you're trying to figure out a situation with your wife or your wife or your husband. There's definitely some of you who are going to be 
are trying to figure out a situation with your wife or your husband, and you're going to be realizing that they are deciding to turn their back on you. So um, whatever here is, uh, whatever is uh, transpiring um, for you Geminis is um, the, the, the first um, week is going to be very productive. Okay. And if you have a business, the first week, and the second week could be very, very productive because the energy of, uh, um, you know, very productive. So whatever you're doing, if you're in business or that sort of sense, it's going to be very productive. But if you are in a conflict with someone, they are going to be victorious over you. There is information that is going to be coming at you. Now, someone who is a Pisces cancer or a scorpion is um, going to be seeing the truth about a situation okay whoever this lady is she's going to be really seeing the truth about a situation of what is transpiring and what is happening but you know this person is it could be a, a mother a father or um a mother a father or some someone who is of a past life is definitely definitely going to be seen a situation of what is transpiring here with you and understanding um you know what has taken place and um the, 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 it is definitely the energy of the um the nurturing mother that is going to be coming up for you guys it's definitely definitely the energy of the nurturing mother that is going to be coming up for you guys okay so whenever the energy of the nurturing mother comes up in a month um, some of you could be taking on this energy of the nurturing energies because I know that some of you Gemini's are very nurturing and very um, open now the energy of the major or conus are very positive because um, for some of you some of you are going to be moving forward with ambition and you're going to be pushing forward and good news is going to be coming in because it's going to be opening up abundance for you but yet still it's going to help you to um, you know take down what no longer serve you which is very very positive and as that happens some of you are going to be finding out that uh, um, it, your wife or partner is only in a relationship f with you um, for the materialistic world it's not a healthy relationship they are only in the relationship um, because of a financial um, this of despondency of financial uh, financial stability okay it's not that it is love and it is true true love and you're going to be finding this out so you are definitely definitely going to be finding this out and what is going to be transpiring is that it's as if information is going to be coming to you that is going to be opening up your eyes it's as if someone who is a Pisces cancer or a scorpion is going to be giving you information that is going to be opening up your eyes and remove the veil that was there and it's as if she's going to be um, helping you to understand certain situation and certain uh, possibilities that is there now whatever you decide to do in the first and second week it's going to be good go ahead as a matter of fact all the weeks are good ex except the last week because the last week some of you are trying to find out the truth about the relationship that you're in so you're looking for the truth am I in the right relationship is this person in the right right relationship um with me is it for the right reasons okay all right now as we look at the energies for the Gemini's um for the, the um, Whatever is that transpiring in the first and second week with the success is that as karmatic situation is going to come to an end for a lot of you. Okay, so it's different scenarios, different situation for you guys. But in the first week, going in the second week, a karmatic situation is going to finally come to an end. Okay, definitely finally come to an end. And what is going to transpire is that you're going to be feeling a sense of relief coming at you. What is the information that is going to be coming out there? It's secret. There was a secret that was kept again, um, from you, and this secret is going to be coming out because someone definitely is going to be telling you what has been happening and what has been transpiring and why um, your financial situation was blocked or 
whatever that was tr uh, happening. Um, um, definitely, um, there is a lot of emotional um, situation that is going to be playing between um, the third week and the fourth week, especially if you are married or you are in a long term relationship or you're in a relationship um, or you're going to be getting married. Um, there is a lot of emotional roller coaster that some of you might decide to walk away from. As we look, um, there is some blockage. You're going to be receiving a message of some blockage. Whatever these blockages are, you're going to be receiving a message um, um, of uh, some blockage that is taking place and um, a theft. So definitely you guys are going to be, the theft is going to be ending, okay? Um, so the, whoever has stolen something, a Pisces cancer or a scorpion woman, um, the secret about her is going to be coming out and whatever the blocks and whoever that was stealing, it's going to be coming up. It's as if whoever this um, person who was stealing, um, they're going to be showing up, okay? So this lady is coming in in a positive and in a negative way. Now, all of what is happening in this month is all about past life. Some of you could be dealing with some um, health issue. You men, um, 45 years and older, are going to be dealing with um, some health issues, okay? Definitely some health issues. Some of you could be receiving message from far away. It could be in a state or um, another place. And you are going to decide um, to turn your back on a marriage or on a relationship or on a long term relationship. You are going to be finding out something. You're also going to be finding out that either your partner or a family member has been stealing from you. Either your, your partner or your family member have been stealing from you. But um, the judgment call in the second week. Um, either um, someone is going to come and tell you or it's going to be coming out okay and this is a, a karmatic situation from the past where you're going to be finding out that someone um, is stealing from you or has stolen from you whatever the blockage is there it's coming to an end okay it was a karmatic situation the theft if some of you or in a relationship and you're feeling as if the relationship is not healthy or um, that the person that is in the relationship with you or only in the relationship for financial stability you're right and track let it go let release yourself of this relationship because that is exactly what is happening. okay that is exactly what is happening now remember that this freedom is um, uh, long and if you want to um, the extended reading <laughs> to find out about um, what's going to be happening in general and the money reading and the rest you can um, uh, connect with us um, with the extended reading okay now we have two energies here these are the animal spirit guides uh, that is going to be um, protecting you in the month of April. Remember that this year we're working with the animal spirit guides, so you can choose one of this card. This is card one, and this is card two. As you choose one of this, and you can't choose both, you have to choose one because this animal spirit guide is going to be helping you to move forward in this month. If you choose card one, it is number nine, six, and three, you can use for timing um in, in in this month and you have uh, the voucher spirit nothing is wasted nothing is wasted so if you think that you have wasted time years a sit wasted times with someone or a situation nothing as wasted so if you choose what card one it is the vulture spirit call upon the vulture spirit to show you that nothing as wasted if you thought that you had wasted some time or a situation nothing as wasted okay card two 
3 plus 7 is 10. You can use 3 and 7. And number 3 has been coming up for a lot of people. 3 and 7 is here. And you have the energy of the lion spirit. And it says, be generous of spirit. Be generous of spirit. Um, calm the beast within you in uh, this um, period. Just calm the beast within you in this period. And you will be okay. We are also working with the energy of the activation cards and you guys have a, um, a tangent journey and this is a four and two so you guys can use these number 42 is a six and it's at a frequency of the tangent journey help us to unlock the hidden knowledge and wisdom that we incredibly have old about how to reach a state of wellness and completion through a sexual expression with ourselves and with others okay so um this is wonderful this is good this is positive so whatever the situation is whatever that has been transpiring in your life and whatever has been happening you are going to be feeling a sense of uh, recovering hidden secrets about yourself or hidden gifts about yourself in this month and it's going to be very wonderful and very, very positive. Ladies and gentlemen, I want to say to you guys, um, each and every person has to go on a journey. I'm seeing a lot of you turning your backs, going on a journey. I'm seeing news coming um, for some of you, some secrets. Definitely secrets are going to be coming out. Um, information is going to be coming out. A light is going to be shed on a situation, and you're going to be understanding um, what is um, has been happening in your life and you're going to be moving forward in a, in a positive note and you're going to be leaving things and situation behind so that is good ladies and gentlemen namaste until next time please remember to cross what cross watch cross watch and and um, see what's coming up for your partner so you know exactly what to expect namaste